Wake up, America. Wake up, America. Wake up, America. It's the Hope Road Radio Station. Coming to you live in your ear. That's right. Metaphysical radio. Giving it to you in your ear. The actual, factual. We're coming to you live. Sit back. I'm your host, Nathaniel Ballhair. Giving it to you right in your ear, directly in your ear. The full sounds. Let's go. Come on, come on. Wake up, wake up. Wake up, America! This is the Hope Road Radio Show, giving you live, live footage, metaphysical, spiritual, consciousness, and com- comedy all wrapped into one. I am your host, Jonathan Ballhair, giving you what you want directly to you, directly in your ear. This is how we give it to you. And we will have so much. We have a great show today. The guest on our show today would be Amir Oha. She will be speaking about what is consciousness? What is this thing called consciousness? And also, we'll have the Green News with John Hamburger giving it to you exactly how they're giving it to you on the streets, right in your ear. I'm your host once again. We'll have great things coming up. And I want you to tune in and watch out for some of the most wonderful uh, experiences and metaphysical consciousness that you can experience right here on this show. I'm your host again, Jonathan, I mean Nathaniel Ball here. I can't get my own name right. And I am giving it to you in your ear. But first, let's give it to you live, a radio commercial spot here from the World World Wellness Retreat. We'll be right back. Hope Road Radio. Hi, my name is Nigi Samoshi, and I'm the co-founder of the Hope Road Wellness Retreat. We'd like to thank you for spending time today with us and enjoying wonderful perspectives on what it is to be healthy, to be in full wellness, and to be conscious in this reality. Thank you for all of your wonderful donations. We'd like to ask that you continue on supporting what we are doing here and what we are trying to do in evolving the world and its inhabitants. We love the Mother Earth and we love the universe and we send out nothing but the beautiful and the most best intentions for you and your family and everyone that is listening to this show. Thank you once again for joining us and also I'd like to remind you that we are here for you. So whatever it is that you'd like to discuss or like to talk about, we are open for any suggestions and any ideas and uh, on possible future shows and topics. We will be an actual uh, existing uh, wellness retreat by May 20th, which is my actual birthday. And I will thank you again so very much for your participation, and we will get right back to the show immediately. Thank yeah. you so very much. The Hope Road Wellness Retreat, a place for your mind, body, and spirit. Thank you. We are back. We are back. I'm your host, Nathaniel Ballhair. Hope Road Radio, giving it to you in your ear, directly in your ear, and we are here live giving it to you with our guest today. Amir Ohash, coming to you to talk to you about what is consciousness. Always seems to be some type of spookiness around this topic, but today we've got someone talking about it that gives it to you right the way it's given to you on the streets. What is consciousness? And he's here, live, in the studio, for you. Amir, what is consciousness? What is it that, what is this thing that, that everyone's going crazy about these days? What is it? First of all, I'd like to thank you for allowing me to come to the show. Uh, my name is Amir Lash, and uh, I have been studying consciousness for a little over 35 years. And, uh, and this thing with consciousness has been something that, that has led me to many paths. And we... Oh, okay, I'm sorry, I was getting a little... I was going into something else, I'm sorry. Okay, what is consciousness? Consciousness is basically like as if you cannot look at it from... A perspective of a three-dimensional perspective. You must look at it from an inner self. That is which is in meaning like almost like understanding that what I am seeing on the outside is a is a like a video playing within my brain in my mind. This sits in the back of the pineal gland. This is where all consciousness stimulates from. It connects to the spiritual self. And it allows you to see the vision, which is a hologram, manifested by your mind and, and your beliefs. This is what put it together. And 
consciousness is something that a lot of people are are beginning now, coming now with the 2012 phenomenon and everything happening. People are now starting to get more conscious. It, there is a, a wave across the planet about it. So yes, I, I believe that this is a great topic to talk about, and I'm honored to be on no the show. No problem, and I want to thank you for, thank, for, thank for you being on much. the show. This thing, consciousness, uh, you, you were saying that it it's from within, I mean, in your mind. I mean, I can actually feel my body. I, I, I don't believe that I'm somewhere else imagining Because there is no out. way to imagine. It is not the imagination that is causing you to see what you are seeing. Remember that there are senses that are, that are also incorporated in, into your consciousness. Your five senses are able to connect to these realities that you believe are true. There is nothing but energy, believe me, my friend. Nothing but energy. And all of this comes together to create what you see as a reality. But in real reality, the true reality is, is within. This is why I tell you all the time to meditate. People yes, don't listen I, to I, me. They I try. Mr. Cuckoo. Yes. But I know. I graduated from the Northern Lights University at Berkeley, one of the greatest colleges ever to put together. And I graduated from there. I've never heard of that. So I've I never... know what I'm saying. Listen to me. Oh, I am from Northern Baghdad. Northern, northern Lights. I, I've northern... studied plenty of things before. So it is consciousness that we must connect with. Yes, my friend. Well, well, I I must say you you have a very convincing way of putting that, but I've still never heard of Northern Lights University. I've I've been all over Berkeley and I've yet to heard of that. I have But anyway, we're gonna get right to some green news with John Hamburger. He's next up. John Hamburger giving you the green news right in your ear. Hamburger, where are you? What is the news? What's happening on the streets? Thank you, thank you for uh, uh, giving me the, uh, uh, thank you. Uh, I am John Hamburger, giving to you the news, the green news, and what's going on out there. There's a lot of things happening. Uh, they're, they've got all kinds of freak of things going on here, and I'm searching and wondering what's happening. I just read just now in the news today, they got a little article put out, uh, something about a robot colonizing Mars. I got a little article right here in my ring. See, got it right here. It says, some, uh, says uh, uh, we'll, well, uh, it's good to know that indeed an event of a planet collapse or under the weight of climate control or climate change or overpopulation, uh, a water crisis, nuclear holocaust or whatever, there are designers out there already preparing for life on Mars. If we do in the, uh, indeed set out to colonize on Mars, the first thing we're going to need is ample breathable air. Uh, uh, a, a greenhouse robot designed to keep plants safe while scavenging for more nutrients are available now. That's what they've got out there. Interesting things happening. Everybody's running around trying to figure out what's happening next. Well, there's good green things going on. Eat your vegetables. Eat your strawberries. Get your root chakra strong and ready for what's happening. Don't sit back and wait for the last minute. 2012's just around the corner. And I'm telling you, I don't eat nothing that's filled with this toxin-filled garbage that they've had out here. I'm staying with Mother Earth. She's my protector, and I'm going to stick to it. So I guarantee you, if my name isn't John Hamburger, that I'm going to give you the green news and what's happening really out here. Smell the air. Feel the universe. Feel the Earth. Eat your vegetables. I'll talk to you later. Get back to the show. Hope Road Wellness Retreat. Let's talk about it.